Let's talk about tuning your acoustic guitar. Why do we need to tune? Well, it's important because different things can affect your tuning, like temperature changes, humidity changes, your tuners may have been knocked out of place if you're taking it in or out of a gig bag or case, and if you just changed your strings, you definitely want to make sure you're tuned up. So I'm using this Fender Acoustic where we have three tuners on either side, and if we go down and name the strings, we have E, A, D, G, B, and E. A reminder, if you just changed your strings, one or the whole set, make sure to stretch out your strings to take up some of the slack that might be on the tuning pegs. And if your guitar sounds like this, you are in the right place. It's time to tune, so let's get started. There are many ways to tune your guitar, the Fender Tune App being one of them. It's a great way to tune using your mobile device anywhere. Let's open up the app. And then one of the first things I want to do is make sure I have the correct instrument selected. So let's go to settings. Now obviously I'm using an acoustic, but I can also select electric or bass. So I have acoustic selected. There's some helpful tone and tuning tips included. Otherwise, there's manual mode and auto mode, which I'm going to use for this demonstration. It's the easiest way to get into standard tuning. I want to remind you also to tune up to the note. We do this to make sure that the string is tight around the peg. If we tune down or loosen the string, there's a greater risk of the string slipping out of tune. Let's get started with our low E. So for this note, I can see that I'm actually flat or below the note, so I need to tune up. Perfect. Let's move on to our A string. So this one I'm actually sharp or above the note, so I want to go back down. And as I mentioned before, I want to go past the note just a little bit so I can tune up to make sure that the string is tight. All right, now go back up. Great. Now let's move on to D. Too flat, need to tune up. Perfect. Now the G string. As you can see, I keep sounding the note to make sure that the note doesn't die as I'm moving towards the target note. Now next is our B. Now this one's sharp, so again, tune down a little bit past the note, and then back up. And finally, our high E string. Again, too flat, so I need to go up. All right, let's see how we did. Perfect. So as I mentioned, there are many ways to tune the guitar. You can stick with the Fender Tune app, or you can use the Fender Online Tuner at Fender.com. You can also use a clip-on tuner or a pedal tuner. Use the tool that seems right for you. Good luck and have fun.